Christina received a subpoena from Ava Jerome's lawyer, compelling her to testify against her father, Sonny Corinthos. Christina then went to the victim's hotel suite. She confronted Miss Jerome and threatened to kill her if she was forced to testify against Sonny. That's not what happened. Christina. When Ms. Jerome refused to be intimidated by Christina's threats, she flew into a rage. She attacked Ms. Jerome, and in the struggle, that's when Christina crashed through the hotel window. That's not even Stop true. Lying, I, that's not what happened. That's what Ava Jerome says happened. And thanks to the photos you so generously provided, the evidence corroborates her statement. The photos show Ava with her hands on Christina, not the other way around. She was defending herself. She was sending her off balance out of a window. Well, now it's for the courts to decide. Come on, get up. Don't move. This is abuse. This is harassment. This is a threat to her physical health and to your employment. Christina was being discharged. She was, in fact, leaving when I arrived. To go home to a clean bed. Not to be dragged off to a police station and thrown in a dirty cell. Jagger, my daughter's in a wheelchair. You just can't walk around. I am here. telling you, if you insist on this, I will call the ACLU, the DOJ, the FBI, and the local press your choice. Fine. Bring the wheelchair. Don't do anything, don't say anything, and I mean nothing. Do you understand? I'll be right behind you. We're going to fix this with you. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court I'll ride with you. You, have the right you can't come. You work for the DA. We can't risk any suggestion of favoritism in any way. Do you understand these rights? I'll keep you posted. Where's Christina? Downstairs being booked. She'll be up soon. You've gone way too far. Is that a threat? No, it's a fact. This is a massive case of jurisdictional overreach. It's abuse of power and it's malicious prosecution. Would you like me to go on? Tell it to the judge. I'm going to tell it to your superior at the FBI about this supposed ongoing investigation. You think I'm making this up? The FBI has been investigating Sonny for decades. You know what I think? I think the FBI is a lot less interested in Sonny than you are. You're off the rails, Jagger, and I can't wait to see you crash and burn. Then why would you leave us to go confront Ava? Because I was angry. I wanted justice for my daughter. I'm, I'm still so angry. As far as justice, I don't... I don't even know if prosecuting Ava will accomplish that. Well... Nothing is going to bring that beautiful baby back to us. That's true. Don't we deserve to know what happened? Because I'm starting to think that Christina falling wasn't actually Ava's fault. You all right, sweetheart? I can't believe this is happening. Where's Molly? I told her to stay behind so Kate's couldn't use the fact that she worked at the DA's office to argue bias. Bias. Agent Cates is the one who's biased. I'm the one who fell from a window and almost died. Who, whose baby did die? Honey, are you in any pain? No, I'm just uncomfortable and I want to go home. We were supposed to pick up the medication at the hospital. Well, we I'm going to have Fran pick it up and bring it back here. I can't believe this is happening. Thank you. Anything for you, sweetheart? It's a nightmare. Is Miss Corinthos Davis' cell ready? It is. Hold that thought. I'm going to find a way to make you more comfortable. Listen, I don't want you to worry, okay? You'll be home before you know it. You think Valentine died? 